Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Distant Worlds Universe. We are at Victory's doorstep. We're literally sitting here at, I don't know, 1% uh, victory. We basically can win by gaining a tiny bit more territory or a tiny bit more economy. Um, and territory we might actually gain relatively soon because if I remember correctly, I do have a couple of cons colony ships in the queue. Let's check. We have no colony ships in the queue. Uh, so that was complete and total bullshit. Uh, what we should do though is look at uh, potential colonies. Potential colonies. We have one potential colony that we could go for. We have a bunch of low quality crappy colonies. Does this sort by goodness? So is this the low, the, the best low quality one? Yeah, we're totally going to colonize that. Um, Sluckus 3 is like way out in the middle of fucking nowhere. That's like all the way down here, right? Yeah, we're not going to colonize Sluckus 3. Uh, but we will colonize uh, this one as well. Why the fuck are you rebelling, Rotian? Let's have you uh, get a mercenary smuggling mission going. So... So yeah, we're, we're basically just trying to get up here to this 90% threshold, and I'm doing it by colonizing two more colonies, so I have 70 colonies, and perhaps getting to the 33% of value that I need to possibly get over the 90 threshold. Uh, I might go after uh, sniping this continental planet if uh, I can't get that threshold. Are my, where are my um, troop fleets? They're here and here. All right, so you refuel, you refuel. Did I, did I build new ground forces? No, and yes. Let's get some more though, because if I have to snipe uh, Laria Kessel, I will <laughs> to win the game. Uh, I have no qualms with winning this game any and all ways. Are you any of my colony ships being built here? Where are my colony ships being constructed? Open uh, ships and bases. So you're... One's being constructed. Where are you? Like... Go to ship. Oh, you're being constructed at Havrekos 3. 35 unbuilt. How long will it take you to be built? 10. 10. 9. 8. 7. Six, five. So it's like about five seconds to build a uh, component. And the other one was being built up here somewhere. Did I see that correctly? Oh, nice. We got the Gravitic Dissociation Field. Uh, that was an exploration ship that we just got. Relicus, is that where this is being built? Construction ship. I'm basically just box draw drawing right here, trying to find any possible location for a construction ship. But we know one is here in the Hafreco system. Where is the other one? You're being built in the Alpha Cassis system. Go to ship. You only have 33 components constructed. Or 37 components constructed. 35, so we'll try this again. We'll start counting a better way this time. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. About eight seconds or so. Uh, so that one's going to take a little bit longer to construct than this one here in the Havreco system. Thanks. Goodbye. This one should be... Uh, yeah, you're doing pretty decent here. So if one, two... Three, four, five. Yeah, it's about five seconds. Five, six seconds, somewhere in there. So yeah, that's all good. How are we do? How are we doing game wise? We're still at eighty nine percent. Be really good to get our economy up a little higher. That's basically, you know, 
If we can get that higher, that'd be really good. We just got to boost some Meridian Shields. This is a totally different shield technology. I don't think that's worth it. Uh, fast mining. Let's get the high-powered extractors and the advanced gas mining um, capabilities. That might help us out here as well. I realize that a lot of times you go down this line here. Um, sentient computer core. Crazy. But yeah, we... Uh, yeah, a lot of times you go down the the build size line because you can get bigger and better and more badass ships. But this game is really about targeted sniping and, and assaults on, on enemies. If you notice that I, I find, if you watch any of my games, I, I use a I use very small wars. You know, I try to take get only one other enemy in a war, then go after them and try to completely crush them. And I use some of the questionable systems that exist in this game to maximize that benefit for myself. So, and then as you saw down here, you know, I was like, oh, there's a planet down here that'd be good for me. So I, I sniped it. Like I just came down and took it and it was nice and easy. And that's why I'm saying, you know, if I have to, I will snipe this planet down here. That is a perfectly reasonable thing for me to do, I think. How's our colony ship doing here? Apparently you can't drag and drop colony ships. I thought you could. Five unbuilt. All right, cool. Thanks, goodbye. No thanks. No thanks. Four unbuilt. Three unbuilt. Two unbuilt. I said two unbuilt. One unbuilt. Come on, finish it up. And done. Fuel up, baby. Fuel up. You got a little bit of fuel. You got enough, I think. Are you actually colonizing this planet? <laughs> wow. I didn't realize you were going literally across the, 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 the game here. All right. So that did put us at the 33% threshold and put us probably right around, like, slightly closer to 90 than we were before. Um, I think we are going to have to snipe that planet. To try to get this victory. I mean, getting anything that would boost our economy would be great. I just don't know what would boost our economy. I, I honestly don't know how you boost economy. First fleet, you need to fuel up. Yes, yeah, so I, I don't actually quite understand how you boost economy. Did you just colonize shit in my territory? You just colonize this goddamn ocean planet? That's that's not cool, game. And now we're done. Wait, did, was that mine and it tripped, or is this because it's gone up to another value? I mean, I could totally snipe that, but I think the one I want to snipe is this one right here. We reject this deal. Goodbye. Now the next thing we want to do is open the diplomacy screen. Um, not the Nemerians. We're looking at Lyria Kessel, who is allied. Wow, they're in mutual defense packs with two people, which would be really bad for me um, in the whole snipe strategy. You have turned these guys into your protectorates. That's interesting. Hmm, maybe we will continue with the economy strategy. Basically, we just need to grow our economy somehow. If I understood how, I would do it. So, I don't want to pirate missions. Potential research locations, I'm fine with. There are no potential resort locations anywhere in our empire. Um, yeah, so right here. Where's the... So we have this research station. Yeah, that's fine. Cruiser. Where's the World Annihilator product project again? That's not that's not where the World Annihilation project is. That's over here, and it's gotta be already taken care of. Fleet. I need a fleet. 
My stomach's going crazy right now. I don't know why. In case you're wondering. Uh, it's going crazy. Yeah, move. Move here, guys. Because I want to see what's going on with this world annihilation project. Meanwhile, yeah, we're just we're just watching this. What we really need, continental planets, trade income. That's what we need. We got to just get some more trade income. We got to find anybody who's who's decently happy with us. You're ca you're you're friendly. Can we oh, we have a free trade agreement with you. These people are cautious with us. As are you. You're cautious. You're cautious. We have a free trade agreement with you as well. So if we, um... What did we just finish here? I wasn't even paying attention. I don't think anything there is necessarily useful. Sure, let's get the advanced medicine. That at least gives me something to th them to do. Let's open our characters. That's what I want to do. Do we have any other ambassadors? We do have an ambassador at Taros. Who sucks. Um, and we have one at an Vectorian. So what we want to do is drop you off at... Um, who doesn't have a free trade agreement with me? Escalion, Esc Escalon, I believe, is where I want to send you. And the reason we want to send you there is because you're at Escalon and you should get a big boost. We have a free trade agreement with you. That was dumb. Um, we have a free trade agreement with you. We have a free trade agreement with you. You don't really like us. You don't really like us. And you guys are cautious. So yeah, maybe the Rikta Industries is what we should be doing. So, so that was a mistake by me, moving her there. Man, we're so close to victory, yet figuring out how to get this last 1% is going to be a pain in my but booty. Did you ever finish your... Your ship yet? You're not quite done yet. Five unbuilt. Yeah, this can be a pain in my patootie. Second fleet, have you finished refueling yet? You've literally been chilling here this entire time. Um, I guess... I don't really want to do that right now. <laughs> the reason I don't really want to do that right now is... Uh, does that affect... My, my number of mutual defense packs, it does. Because I didn't honor it. But I have a mutual defense pack with the people... Oh, no, it was a different... Oh, it was a different one. I should have honored that. These guys are pissed off at me now. Yeah, I should have, I should have honored that. So I'm going to send you back to Vekunder. That was completely my fault. Yep, they're terminating trade, which is actually going to hurt us even more, probably, because our economy is going to go down even s slightly more than, than it was. Yeah, fourth fleet. No, it was fifth fleet that I sent off on the grand mission, right? Yeah. Fifth fleet, have you arrived? You have. We have no desire on this mission. Where is... This thing. It should be right here. The World Annihilator Project should be right here. We don't see any World Annihilator Project. All we see apparently is an abandoned ship there. Abandoned ship there. Let me, um... Turn back on civilian ships so I can see where these shit, this shit is. Doesn't look like it's here. It looks like they must have finished that. Alright. Let's send the fleet home. Well, we're going to try to repair our relationship with uh, these guys. Yeah, so these guys are a little upset with us right now. This should go way up, though, because of her when she arrives. Oh, you're already there. 
So yeah, this should go way up soon. Yeah, I totally misread which force had gone to war with each other. That, that pisses me off. That pisses me off because that was easily something to, to correctly read. <laughs> like, I could have done that correctly. I just... I just didn't. Yeah, and if we can get another... um Another... Alliance going, which is what we're hoping to do at some point. Oh, these guys are really happy with us again. So we don't want a mutual defense pact right now, but getting that free trade agreement again might help us get some trade back, which might help a little bit, maybe. Bueller. So yeah, we, we want to see how well we can basically push these guys back into the forefront. These guys are pleased with us. Cautious with us. My reputation went down because I didn't actually uh, defend my ally. Also a problem. Um, let's come back to you. Speak with you. Negotiate a trade proposal. Wait, who are the Bansarat hegemony? I think those are my friends, right? No, they're not my friends. But they are trade partners with me. The Banoseret hegemony. I really don't want to get into uh, wars with these guys. Speak with the Akdarians. But if we can get a mutual defense pact going at some point soon, that'd be great. So, negotiate a trade proposal. What if we did this? What if we did this? Alright, cool. Now, um... You, speak with you, negotiate into the war, end our war with you. Give me these two. Holy crap. Uh, let me just give you the million bucks. Yeah, let me just give you a million bucks. about like this okay what about this what about this what about this Jesus Christ how about this how about this all right cool and then apparently I'm at war with the Le the Learia dudes We'll negotiate into the war. Yeah, this is... You're even cheaper. Let's, uh... See what we can trade... For what? I'm giving away a lot. Let's just get something else. Let's negotiate into the war. I'm just gonna give you... 400,000. Would you accept this? Good. Alright. And then finally... You, who are friends with me, or enemies with me, negotiate into the war. Good. Alright, cool. So, simultaneously, we have ended the war, gotten some t some stuff back, including our planet back. Um, speak with you. Uh, change relationship. Propose free trade agreement. Alright, well, we're not going to get the free trade agreement right now. Now we're still- the war's over, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, so the war is over. That's fun times. <laughs> I think it's time to end the episode. I don't know how if that that uh, benefited me or not in any way, but 
I did end the war. So that's that's good, I guess. We're still at 88%. If we can finish this, we'll get another, you know, one or so percent. Um, but we'll do that on the next episode. So thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it. Oh, wait. Let's uh, negotiate a trade proposal. I'm actually going to be, like, ridiculous here and give up all this stuff and take as much money as we can. Um, so you know, we'll do that later. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you all next time.